my daughter is a patient of Dr. Alexander. So she told me I had trouble. And then she told me, Ma, why don't you uh, uh, come to my dentist? So she made an appointment for me. And I'm very happy. And I'm very pleased. And next week, I bring my 93 year old aunt. Still hurts when you bite? No. So it feels better when you bite yeah. now. Okay, that's a very good sign. Mm -hmm. That means that your bite shifted and you were hitting those teeth harder than the other one. Okay. So I'm gonna take out the temporary filling and the old silver. Again, this should not bother you. <laughs> I was shocked to see my old teeth wing me.
found myself good. Most of the uh, block that we remove with a diamond, we then use diamond impregnated rubber wheels to do both the first step of polishing and then put an actual high shine on it. This eliminates all of the burr marks that the diamonds that cut it may have left on the surface. Because they're relatively fine, there's not a lot of polishing that needs to be done in order to get a very smooth surface. Unlike the porcelain that's just hand stacked in a dental lab, there's no porosity. All of this is unitized. So we're taking an optical impression with a uh, laser, special laser camera that is able to measure uh, the preparation precisely. We then design it on a computer which allows us to have exactly what we want to match the contours of the adjacent teeth the margins fit beautifully because you're not dealing with multiple steps of an impression that can distort, the die stone that can distort, having to make a mock-up. Then casting that small thimble of either ceramic or uh, metal. Then they have to put porcelain that's hand stacked, which introduces all sorts of uh, problems. I did everything, right? Yep. We accomplished the whole two yeah. hours and an hour and a half. Our daughter is, told me, Ma, you should go to my doctor. And then I told my aunt and said, let's do it. Let me make an appointment for her. So little by little, the old friend will uh, see you. Well, <laughs> as you've seen in the waiting room, we have uh, two and three generations of patients yeah, yeah, yeah. and I just went to the wedding of somebody who I treated his parents yeah, yeah. when they first got married and wow. over these last 31 years uh -huh. and then uh, I'm hoping that uh, I've treated this person's grandparents, I've treated yeah, yeah. his parents, I've treated him and he just got married. Wow. So we're hoping in a few years to have our first fourth generation in the practice. Well, he has a lot of experience and he's a pleasure to work with.